welcome back. Well, I did some stuff off camera. I knew you'd be disappointed because you like to see boring stuff, but I did it anyway. So what I got here is I've got uh, every one of these wires that was connected to this transformer labeled. I've got my drawing here to show me where all they go, all every place they go. So uh, we've got one casualty here. This uh, this came off of the paper. This is just a paper, an insulating paper, and this is just attached to the paper. The actual wire is in here, but I got to be very careful with it. Oh, and so with that, I think we're going to start uh, to take this off. Be right back. Okay, so there's actually a screw that goes all the way through to the back side here. You just love it when they don't cooperate with you. Uh, that one's hiding behind this can. Okay, we've got it now. And of course, it's not going to cooperate and come off nice and easy the last few turns. Then I really didn't expect it to. Okay, there's one. Alright, now we're going to be okay as long as we don't take these two screws out. So let's see if we can just push these through. Well, we don't need them through all the way, just enough to get to these screws on the bottom. But that one, of course, is not cooperating. Have a nice precision precision hammer here. Oh, it's hitting the can. Okay, that should be good enough. Let's uh, let's see what we can do here. All right, it's going to be difficult. You ever try to change one small thing on your car and you find you got to disassemble the engine to do it?
Ah, oh, boy. Okay. Ah, there we go. I don't know if you can see that now, but how it's crooked. It's up on this side. These two screws will pull, pull right out. They're on slots. See how much easier that is? Hmm. Yeah, maybe I better look underneath to see if there's nuts on the underside. And there is. Of course there is. Not going to cooperate. Not going to do it. I don't want this to lay on the... coils. You know, right about now, I'll bet you're thinking, he's crazy. You know what? I agree with you. Uh-oh. I think somebody would All right, never mind. I don't know if you can see that. This is the shim that they had put underneath here. Some kind of a washer. Almost looks like it's homemade, but I don't know. And here's our nifty little transformer. All the, you know, it doesn't look too bad, except for this one. I don't know what we're going to be able to do about that one. Maybe, maybe I can just glue it back down again. Maybe I ought to take a big long screw and screw it right in. That ought to work, huh? <sighs> okay, that's that.
Boy, that makes the radio a lot lighter. <laughs> okay. What next? A lot of crud. Yuck. Uh, well, I can take this off with no problem. That's just got a screw. This has got a rivet. Have to be drilled out. Let's see what we got here. Well, you know, these wires are very brittle. I think I'm going to have to change them all. Very, very brittle. It's just crunching underneath the fabric. And the fabric's uh, actually worn through in a couple of places. So. I think we're going to have to replace them. We're going to have to take these three coils off. And the tuning capacitor. And this. <laughs> it's the, pop, the uh, pilot light. But that's easy to take off. Okay. Uh, well, we're going to let this... Uh, and here and next time we come back I think we'll be taking off the the coils and such so thank you for watching have any questions comments please leave them in the comment section below please subscribe and thanks for watching see you on the next one